Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter. Um, I'm taking a break from the house. Um, frustrated. We bought um, a new queen size set, mattress set for our guest room um, to go on the bed that I had bought to go in there. The rails are too short. <laughs> so now we had to order the rails that aren't coming in till an, for another week, so we can't finish that room till next week, so that's on the back burner. And um, so now I'm here recording for you guys. This is a Tonic Studios order. Um, I think I ordered a couple of weeks ago, and I just haven't gotten around to it. I've been doing other stuff. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you stick around the spell if you like what you see please hit that subscribe button. Ding that bell next door if you want to get notifications of my future videos. Thumbs up, likes, always appreciated. And any questions or comments, please leave them down below. Um, something I want to share. Um, this is, uh, not these. I bought these. These I bought on Amazon. It's different enamel, clay enamel, or like clay bits for shakers. But this is how I sh sh sure. store um, all my shaker stuff or like these are MFT. So these are like slider bits and that's supposed to look like ice cubes. Um, but I got these on scrapbook.com and it, the set comes with this large. Now I'm a little bummed because you can see there's a crack there. Right there. And then it comes with one of these. Um, so I ordered two sets. Um, I'm going to order some more because I have a ton of um, shaker stuff. And to me, yeah, even if you stack it, it's okay because it's clear. So you can see, still see what's in there. And for me, if you can see it, you're going to use it. So I'm probably going to see if I can get like five or six more sets of these. I also have... They're in the bottom of a drawer, so I'm not going to get them out. But I also have the the trays that have the different size, like, Tic Tac containers. Um, I use those, too. Um, but I'm going to be honest. I think I like these better than that brand. Um, one of these days when I get to, like, starting recording the room, like, how I store stuff, uh, you'll see what I'm talking about. But... Um, again, the love-hate relationship with acrylic, you can see through it, but it is, um, has a tendency to crack or break easy. This lid, I am going to see if, since it hasn't completely broken, I'm wondering if I can get, um, somehow squeeze some, like, um, super glue in there maybe? See, there it is. I'm sure it would have broken off completely a long ago, but I, I, you know, I don't get into these all the time. But anywho, y'all are here for my tonic. Um, this has been here for a bit because I kept meaning to share it because I was putting some shaker stuff away. And I left it out because I meant to share it in the last few videos. Anywho... The first thing I'm going to share, that was a bundle. So this order, yeah, so we're, it's been a bit. I ordered this on the 27th of July. And this is the, this was during their birthday week. And apparently this was $17.99, I think. Anywho. I'm going to pull it out. I hadn't ordered one of these, and so I wanted to check it out. But it's a storage container for 8.5 by 11 or like A5 or A4 cardstock. Um, I really like it because if you look, regardless of which size side you use, it's like the, it has feet. Now, I don't know if these sit. Oh, you know what? They do. So when you stack them on top, they're not sliding around. I like that. I'd only gotten one because I didn't know uh, what I wanted yet. 
but I can, and all of this came in there too, all of this cardstock. So uh, we have champagne, bright white, cream, espresso brown, ocean blue, teal blue. I think that is so beautiful. Love that. I love this. This is pistachio green. That is one of my favorite colors of green. We have must and mustard yellow. Um, so all of this and that container were one bundle. And one thing I love about the tonic um, classic card, it is textured. I love textured cardstock. To me, it gives more depth because um, of the texture. And also, it is solid core. Um, not a lot of companies do solid core. I know Stampin' Up! does. Um, Basil. Um, tonic. I think MFT does as well. Um, I'm just not a big fan of white core. Um, to me, it's for a specific use, like if you're trying to go distress. Other than that, I'm not, you know, I don't get much, if any. Um, so anyway, so that was a bundle. And I am definitely, I think, going to hunt down. Uh, some more of these containers now. Um, so very happy with that. Yes, I have had this since the 27th and I had not opened that box yet. Uh, so got that. Um, the freebie um, you know, they were giving out was a bag. So I think it says craft, sleep, eat, repeat, I believe. So eat, sleep, craft, repeat. So that was a uh, freebie for the order. Uh, got a new, another pair of these craft, they call them crafters snip. And uh, I really like those, so I grabbed another one. Now, I do wish it had like a protector down here because that can be rather dangerous. But anywho, let me put this in the garbage pile. The other freebie I got was um, another one of these key rings. This is a red one. I think I officially have all the colors that Tonic has out there, I think. There's three here. Anyhow, so there's that. And... I got this bundle. It is called the 4973. It's called the Christmas Cheer Stamp and Stencil Set. And I paid 18 for this. So you have this stamp set. So we have a deer. I love wreaths. Um, love stockings, poinsettias, um, loving the ornaments. I do wish that there were actually dies for these, but I can fussy cut. Um, sometimes I, you know, like I'll stamp a whole bunch of images and then I'll sit there like watching TV and I'll just start uh, cutting um, out images. So um, I like that. And I love this deer. There aren't, I don't like lots of deer. I love deer. Um, my friend Karen though, oh dear. Um, yeah, she's like a deer fanatic, which I love. It's so funny. Um, but I do think that one, I think it's really cute. We have, don't eat your tin, don't get your tinsel in a tangle. It's the season to sparkle, peace on earth and jingle all the way. And to, to both of you at Christmas. And then we have the stencil. So that was one bundle. And let's see, I'm trying to see. Yeah, so one, two, three. Yep. All right. So this was the last bundle. This bundle is called the. It's just called the B Day U Seven. It was twenty two forty nine. So it came with another one of these. So I think I'm going to drop one of these uh, 
I'm sending a box out to my sister. She may or may not. I'll, I'll ask her first. So there was that. And I think I said this bundle was, yeah, this bundle was $22.49. So I got that. It came with another stamp cleaning cloth. Um, I have a whole bunch of these. I actually have a drawer of these, but it's not just Nouveau. I've got Nouveau, um, I think Lawn Fawn, Stampin' Up. I've got a couple different brands of uh, these stamp cleaning cloths. They're fantastic. Um, it came with these crystal drops. Gotta hold it just right. Garbage. This is gorgeous. I don't know that I have this color. It's called Autumn Red. This is a crystal drop, so if you're new to these guys, um, you can put them down and they dry like enamel dots. Like, direct, you know, if they're adding enamel dots to a project. It came with a pack of the Aqua Shimmers, and they're, this one is called Glitter Floss, or Glitter Gloss. So, that. And it came with these Aqua Flows. This is called Festive Season. The colors are um, matted or red, pressed olive, and baked cherry. I love this thing. Um, this is the glitter mister. Uh, now, gonna let you know, this works best with like fine or extra fine glitter. If you put the chunky stuff, it's not gonna work well at all. Um, what you do, I don't have one out. Hold on. So, put your glitter in there, and then to, you to make to make it work, you turn this out, and then you just pump. And um, you can take like a liquid adhesive, put it on something, and then spray. And it's you know you can control how much how little glitter you want in that area. But these are really awesome. Like I said, I use them with um, fine and extra fine glitter. Two more good or four more goodies left. We have another uh, crystal drop, and this is in dirty bronze. I think it'll have a bronze. It looks more like coffee with lots of creamer in it. <laughs> we have another crystal drop. So I get these things for these for when I'm cutting thread. It's not very good at trying to cut paper. This is Olive Branch. We have glitter accents, and the glitter accents are like, um, I've got a whole bunch of them right over here. <sighs> Stickles. I think this one needs to be mixed up, though, because it is... Oh, well, I popped the crystal off the top. Anywho... We gonna check it out, and it's no big deal if you pop that off. It it sticks right back on there. Well, I hear Sammy is getting ready to break something, and when it dries, it'll be it'll be like crystal clear and super sparkly. It's got that little Hershey Kiss top on, um, dip on it, but if you take it and you just, um, it'll be easier if you're on cardstock because it's firmer, but you tap it, it's going to knock that little bump off the top, not so much on regular paper, anywho. 
And the last item is some embossing powder. And I don't think I have this color. I don't. This is called, oh, Medici Crimson. Yes, Medici. That is how you say that. If you're familiar, they were like a a powerful, They were they Spanish or Italian? I want to say they were Italian. But anyway, the Medicis, they were this fa famous family and lots of crazy stuff. Um, if you watched, is it Rain? Um, the Prince, um, whatever his name was, his mother, um, you know, the older I'm getting, the be the, the worse my memory is. So I'm sure some of y'all have watched, it was from the 80s, I believe, but Anne of Green Gable, Anne of Avonlea, uh, I can't remember the actress, but that actress played the, the, Prince King's mother, uh, something Medici, I can't think of her name, but, um, or who, you know, some people say Medici, Medici, um, I don't, you know, I don't know, I could be wrong either way, but that is how you say that, uh, Medici Crimson, and it doesn't look like it is a sparkling, actually, no, it might have a little shimmer to it when it is heat embossed. But yeah, so that was this uh, tonic order. Um, I have some other stuff I need to share, but I'm not in any hurry at the moment to get it recorded. Uh, I just thought I needed to take a break from what I was doing. And now I need to go see what uh, Sammy has knocked down and broken now. He, I have just, he has two nicknames, Freight Train and Bulldozer. Um, he's just... He is a bull in a china shop, that is for sure. Anywho, y'all have a great night, great rest of your weekend. Um, I don't know what my next video is going to be. Um, like I said, I've just I've got a lot on our plate right now. Um, trying to get the guest room put back together for company. Um, fin you know, repacking for the cruise because I'm trying to take less. Um, Went to the dentist regarding the crown that I swallowed and got awful news. I, the sad, the sad thing is the tooth that lost the crown, the dentist isn't even concerned about that one right now. I have two other crowns that somehow, because of the root canal, because you know, root canals, they kind of, they scrape out all your nerves so you don't feel anything, but both of those have cavities. And so now, now they're more concerned about getting those crowns out and trying to either, well, one of them they think they can save. The other crown, I'm actually being sent out to a periodontist because they want to pull that crown and tooth out. So that's money that I wasted. But, uh, and put in another bone graft. Yay me. Um, and then hope, I've got thousands of dollars worth of work that I'll have to do on my mouth and it's just stupid. So I'm frustrated about that. I came home pretty mad yesterday. And not, I know it's not my dentist's fault, but, and I take good care of my teeth, except for the ice. But anywho, uh, love y'all to pieces. I'm going to get back to all, everything I'm trying to accomplish right now. Y'all have a great day. Love y'all to pieces. Bye-bye.